Yo, bit of three player city and knights. Um, on Catan. Okay, <laughs> we've got started. <laughs> Scarlet gets impatient. Let me show you. Okay, should be good. And we're good. So, looks like I'm last to act, which seems to be quite often actually I'm last to act. Right, I'm trying to clear salt up from my mat, right. My desk mat. I'll also be chowing down on licorice throughout. Okay. Yeah. Not much in the way of bricks and stuff, is there? Sheep's a challenging one. Oh, but not crazy challenging because... Yeah, it is actually, it is a challenging one. Let's get... Let's get a hay out here. I mean a hay, a settlement out here. Um. Let's work towards the brick port there. And then let's get a... City on here. And fingers crossed that an ore comes up in time. Okay, so I've got a reasonable chance on the bricks here. Don't have much in the way of bricks. That's unusual, Norman swords. Hmm. I really could do with getting on that nine brick. Scarlet's going to struggle for hay, uh, for sheep. So. Hmm. He's offering out a sheep there. I would have taken that if I was Scarlet. Hmm. Now, can anybody do me a log for a brick? And then we'll give me a sheep for brick. Oh. I'm going to make myself sick on this little fish. You can just tell. 
really want a five to pop up. Get that knight to protect that city. So that's the main thing. Now, if I plot that knight at the end of my double road, that might protect me a bit against normal sort of building down that way. And then I've got bugs to my left at the bottom there. My climbing got cancelled today, so I'm just going to get fat on the crush instead. Oh, another log. Oh my god. See, I could ask the open question, who's got the brick? But nobody responds to that. If I get a settlement down on that brick, I'm happy to sort of forfeit a city, really. Just to get that brick income. Oh, brilliant. Okay. There's a knight. And even if it lands on a... Seven coming up next. Don't actually like licorice. I like the sweets which have a bit of licorice in, but I'm not keen on the um, pure licorice. Okay, so it looks like I'm going to be uncontested for that brick. Wow. I've actually potentially got a city on the go here. A second city. Has anybody got a break at all? I need to drop a knight down there anyway. I haven't got enough for a city now. So let's mine and swap that stone for a brick. The second city would have meant we all lose a city, but the only person keeping the city would have been me. No, I could head my head out to that hayport, but the trouble is the hayport's not on an intersection, so it's a sort of a lot. Of, it's an expensive reach to get to that hayport.
And that's quite a fruitful board, isn't it, for everybody at the moment, by the looks of it. You know, we're, we're hardly any, we've only just had the first ship. I've got another settlement. Scarlet's got a second settlement. Can't can't do that really for the hay. I've got such a good a decent income of hay it seems. Well I've had. Wow. I'm gonna play my crane and unlock this. In while I can. Let's activate that knight. I always like a knight defending my wheat. Because if you end up with a knight that isn't defending the wheat and the wheat gets blocked, then you can't ever activate the knight. Two cities on the board now. Irrigation's a pretty cool card, and mining's a pretty cool card. Oh god, so I feel sick now, honestly, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> oh, I don't like a victory point at this stage. This really smacks me ahead. We all need logs. It takes the pressure off, doesn't it, when you have a city wall? <laughs> That's just paid off. He's desperate to get onto that um, brick, obviously. Which, but he's got no breathing income, so you need to be really. I would like to get another couple of stone, really, at this stage. to swap full wheat for a log I'm not looking away logs. He's got two knights. Oh yeah, no one's all. So I can't put another city on the board because there isn't enough to defend. Oh, there will be now. If I do get a stone. Mm-hmm. That inventor card that swaps the number tokens around is bloody pal. Could really do with getting on that six hex, you know.
There we go. There's that stone. What commodity did he name, I wonder? Oh! Oh! Right, that's a licorice dump. Oh dear. I bought that for the cinema, but I need to. Try and get down onto that. Six hay. Let's see how that goes. It was a licorice breakfast basically. Yeah, I thought I thought it was gonna be plonking itself in down there, so I didn't want to really want to head out that way. It's a good unlock to have that science. It gives you a card of your choosing whenever it doesn't land on you. It's definitely a sweet unlock to have. I think it's gonna end up on Norman Sword. No. No. Wow. So what what happens if I trade this in? Oh, I should have played my master merchant, shouldn't I? Before the merchant. You can play the diplomat card on me now. No. Yeah. Which is, which is a bit pointless really. He would have been better playing it on his own pointless road than moving it across. But it's bitterness from you. <laughs> 
he would have sealed himself the longest road. Well, maybe to, well, he's, he's on for the longest road anyway. It'd be hard to compete against him. But I, I really just didn't want to be burning two bricks on the uh, engineer card, to be fair. The bricks have been very rare, although saying that, I've been feeling now that logs will be rare. He's unlocking these things left, right, and centre. I haven't. I would have expected. Well, I suppose I got my X downgraded, but I'd have expected to at least have unlocked my. Oh God! Do I get a knight out on the board now? My uh, cloth progress. I think. A few scarlet. that you've avoided me as well. I've got to get rid of quite a few cards here. That's got my science unlocked anyway, that's, that's a good thing. Blue cards are more sort of attack cards, aren't they? Oh no, there we go. I'm being attacked as we speak. Half my cards, is it? Still all right for me. That uh, no no net change for me. With the nine moving. Oh man. I honestly didn't play the resource card before. At least with the Master Merchant I get to choose the cards I want. Um, I don't know if there's much chance of Scarlet getting ahead. We'll let him take that point for the moment and then um, yeah I could I could actually put another knight down couldn't I upgrade them both
It's been sat on his tent, that Robert, for a long time now. I thought I'd unlocked my science. I need to work on that then. Wow, we've been playing a lot over the last three days, and Scarlet's won one, Norman Swords won two. But you go going really. Wait, how many rows have I got? Seven. Oh, I have a bit more than that. Oh, he's, he can build an eighth road now, can't Oh, he can build a settlement. He's one. Do you not have a log? I have to put my merchant onto my stone, which is gutting, really, just to get a log out there. He's going to have to build two roads now. she's going to struggle with. And he's got two logs. So see if I can do that for a sheep. It's 
to get. Right, let's just get that upgraded anyway. I could do commercial harbour, all right. So we'll offer him, I think. Come on, quickly, anyone, and then I can swap it for a sheep. Proper settlement. Maritime trade, those two for a sheep. Proper settlement, we're done. Ooh, that was a close call. Right. I'll see, see, I'll see if they want another one. They probably won't. <laughs> well, he won't. We'll see. We'll see. I'll just make a phone call one second. No, that's it. <laughs> For now, anyway. We'll have another one in a bit. All right, take it easy.